using the new Block Scout user interface. What is a Block Explorer? Block Explorers are websites that run full ar archival nodes of the various blockchains, index the information of the network's databases, and show the information to the public. This is a new level of transparency in the world of finance, not only because the information is available, but because ordinary users can use these third-party services to track and audit the blockchains. In banking, all this information is a black box. The data on these websites may be organized by block, by transactions or address, and often have more statistics and charts that are useful to analyze the activity in the networks. What is Block Scout? Block Scout is the most used block explorer for the Ethereum Classic ETC blockchain. Their block explorer supports the Ethereum Classic mainnet and the Mortar testnet. The link to see the ETC network statistics is the following etc.blockscout.com. The link to the Mortar testnet is the following etc mortar dot blockscout.com using the new blockscout user interface blockscout updated their user interfaces for both the etc mainnet and mortar testnet and launched them at the proof of work summit which was held in prague in september of this year in the next few sections we will show a guide of how to use their new block explorer user interface for the etc mainnet 1. Go to the new URL. The old URL for the ETC Block Scout instance was blockscout.com forward slash etc forward slash mainnet. Now the new URL is etc.blockscout.com. Type it on your browser and go there. 2. Open the main menu and see the options. When you get to the Block Scout ETC Explorer home, you will see a chart with the ETC transaction count and the box at the top to enter addresses, trans transaction hashes, block numbers or token symbols. If you click on the blockchain tab on the left menu, you will see four explorer options, transactions, blocks, top accounts and verified contracts. Three, see transactions. If you click on the transactions link on the blockchain tab, you will go to the transactions page with a list of transactions in the ETC blockchain. The information will be organized by transaction hash, type, method, block number, the form and the, the from and to addresses, the value in ETC and the fee paid. 4. C blocks. If you click on the blocks link on the blockchain tab, then you will go to the blocks page. In it, you will see all the blocks of ETC organized chronologically. The information of the blocks will be organized by block number, size in bytes, which was the, the, um, the miner that mined it, the number of transactions, the gas used and the rewards. 5. See top accounts. If you click on the top accounts link, in the, block, in the blockchain tab, you will be directed to the top accounts page. In it, you will see the top accounts in ETC ordered by size. 6. See verified contracts. If you click on the verified contracts link in the, in the blockchain tab, you will be directed to the verified contracts page. In it, you will see the verified smart contracts in ETC. Verified smart contracts are those whose bytecode in the blockchain match the expected source code created by the developer teams. 7. Address lookup. To look up the state of an, of an address in ETC, you need to go to the home of the Block Scout ETC Explorer and enter, the desired, and enter the desired address on the corresponding field on the top box and press enter. 8. Address details. When you press enter, you will be taken to that address's profile page, which will contain all its relevant data. 9. Explore the Tokens tab. If you click on the Tokens tab on the left menu, you will be taken to the Tokens page. 
in it you will see tokens on ETC ordered by number of holders. 10. Explore the Charts and Stats tab. If you click on the Charts and Stats tab on the left menu, you will be taken to the Ethereum Classic Stats page. In it, you will see many useful statistics of the net ETC network, including the average block time, total transactions, account growth, etc. 11. For developers, explore the API tab. If developers wish to use the Block Scout ETC APIs, then they can explore the API tab on the left menu. In it, they, they will see four options. REST API, GraphQL, RPC API, and ETH RPC API. Thank you for watching this Ethereum Classic video. To learn more about TTC, go to ethereumclassic.org. Thank you very much.